Good afternoon, everyone. Okay, this is a very tricky slot, uh, standing between you and your lunch. But uh, I'm not going to take a very long time, just 10 to 12 minutes. And if I take more, the lunch is on me. Uh, so over the next 10 minutes, uh, I'll walk you through uh, an invisible threat to digital advertising, which is ad frauds. Uh, all of us know what ad fraud is all about, but let us try to understand the scale of the ad fraud. Uh, and to understand the scale of ad fraud, we first need to understand the scale of digital advertising. So by the end of 2023, digital advertising will be almost half of all the advertising spends in India, which means we are talking of numbers of about 51,000 crore annually will be spent on digital advertising. Of this, there are estimates that close to about 10% of budget is wasted on invalid traffic and ad fraud, which means the size of ad fraud in India is close to about 5,000 crores. We have been, uh, uh, you know, uh, now whenever we talk of ad frauds, right, uh, the general perception is that, oh, when I'm advertising with third party networks, you know, that's where the ad frauds are. Most of the self-reporting networks are pretty clean source. But that is not what we have seen. When Traffic Guard has worked with advertisers in India and globally, what we have seen is this uh, ad fraud is pretty much visible across uh, all the uh, different digital media channels. Some of our estimates are, uh, in terms of your Google PPC campaigns, we have seen close to about 12% of your spends are wasted on invalid traffic or ad fraud. Close to about 47% of installs are invalid or attributed to the wrong source uh, uh, because of the ad frauds and about 23% of conversions are invalid due to misattributions, right? So we pretty much see it, it is uh, across all the channels that we are, uh, but that advertisers or marketers deploy. Now we have been talking about invalid traffic and ad fraud. So what is the difference between that, right? Invalid traffic, uh, let me help you define that. Invalid traffic is a slightly broader term. Uh, it means uh, a traffic coming from a not from a genuine user or with a genuine interest to convert, right? So it's a slightly more broader term and it's not just limited to ad fraud, but also includes uh, excessive level of engagements from a single device, uh, you know, low quality of traffic and traffic outside your uh, domain or outside your uh, geographies. Ad fraud on the other hand is, is a kind of invalid traffic which is mostly driven intentionally uh, to harm your campaign objectives most likely it is driven to kind of uh, uh, gain the, uh, or do the financial gains, for the financial gains, right, by the, by the partners. Types of ad fraud. Most of us are, are familiar with the kind of ad frauds that we are talking about, but still some of the very prevalent and popular ones are location fraud, bots, malwares, click farm, domain spoofing, ad stacking, cookie stuffing, incentivized ad. These are some of the ad frauds that we, that quite prevalent and we see it across different channels that we work with or across different channels that marketers deploy for customer acquisition. About us, now, we have, now that we have already uh, quantified the amount of, in, uh, what is, uh, you know, the amount of ad fraud that is there in India, uh, the kind of ad fraud that we are talking of and where all it is visible, now I have been talking about it, right? Let me just introduce Traffic Guard to you. So we are an ad fraud, we help you prevent uh, any kind of ad frauds and protect your budgets any, against any kind of invalid traffic and ad frauds, right? Uh, we have spent more than six years uh, in, in developing digital measurement advertising solutions um, as well as fraud mitigation solutions. Uh, we are a listed company, listed on uh, Australian stock exchanges. Uh, more than half of our team comprises of, uh, you know, digital, uh, uh, the uh, the data analyst or, or the technical or the data engineering team. Uh, we are, a, most importantly, we are a Google certified ads partner as well as the cloud partner. And on a monthly basis, we measure close to about 100 billion plus transactions. Uh, transactions here means the digital currency of impression, click, installs, or any other conversion that a marketer would want us to measure and verify for them. <clears throat> What is the differentiator, right? There are, today there are quite a few solutions that are available in the market and in which talk of uh, helping marketers identify ad frauds and invalid traffic. Uh, I will, over next uh, five minutes, I'll just walk you through the key differentiator for Traffic Guard. Like I said, we pretty much operate across different channels. So taking the mobile app or the mobile app user uh, acquisition journey as the first channel. Uh, what we do differently is we just don't detect 
but prevent invalid traffic for you in real time by integrating at a click level with affiliate partners. What this allows us to do is identify the invalid traffic at the very first opportunity. Once we identify, we prevent all these clicks from getting into a, a measurement platform or the attribution uh, pool from where the chances of misattribution are the highest. So which means it's not just about detecting, but preventing it in real time, and at the same time ensuring that this, the, the, the journey does not continue ahead, right? And also help you identify installs uh, that are probably uh, not, or get, getting missed by your MMPs, or what we call it as a mobile measurement platform. When it comes to PPC, like I mentioned in the beginning, we are a Google certified verification partner. What this allows us to do is uh, directly integrate with your Google ad account and help you identify invalid traffic with complete transparency and the details about uh, you know, device ID, IP, location, timestamp, all of the details given in real time. Uh, provide you the breakdown of invalid threats, right? One is saying that there's an X amount of threat, but they provide a full funnel multi-point solution and, and not just look at conversion in isolation. Uh, we help you identify conversions that are fraudulent or maybe non-incremental in nature to you and help you manage the terms and condition of your affiliate campaign, uh, like many if, if there is a traffic which is including traffic control, so traffic coming outside of your geography or maybe Google arbitrage or even brand safety in that case. Across uh, all the channels, the most important part is we offer complete transparency, provide you a full funnel view, and all of this is happening in real time. So it's all automated and real time. Uh, these are some of our, these are some of the logos that we really wear with a lot of uh, pride on our sleeves. Uh, these are some of the brands that use our solutions in India and globally. So brands like Disney, Luxury Escapes, Gojek, Dreezer, they use our solutions globally uh, across different channels. So whether it is PPC, whether it is affiliate, whether it is mobile app. Uh, closer home in India, we are working with brands like India Gifting Portal, Happy Fairs, uh, Rupi Ridi, which is a fintech. There is a travel client, which is Make My Trip. So if you look at it, wherever there is a direct D2C interaction, right? So, so, so clients across fintech, entertainment, edutech, uh, travel, uh, uh, the quick commerce, you know, they, they would find uh, our solutions more relevant in terms of improving the return on ad spets. Some of our agency partners that trust our solution uh, to kind of help their client improve return on ad spends. And uh, if you look at it at the last panel, we have some of our uh, technology partners who like-minded technology partners, I would say, who believe in providing complete transparency to marketers. So we have partnerships or, or integrations in place with affiliate management platforms like Raventrack, Impact Guru, Liftoff, uh, across uh, income access to name few. And when it comes to mobile measurement platforms, again, we have integrations in place with all the leading measure, mobile measurement platforms like AppsFire, Edges, Singular, Kochava, right? Moving on. Uh, I'll just walk you through a case study. What I have done is I have picked up uh, two case studies. One is for for the uh, for the for the uh, for the PPC uh, campaigns, and one is for the mobile app campaigns. On on PPC, uh, this is one of the uh, gifting portals in India, uh, which is at a growth stage, uh, and they wanted to improve their return on ad spends and see how Traffic Guard could help them kind of improvise their return on ad spends. Uh, as a part of the process, we typically do a two weeks of uh, trial with any client wherein we just detect, wherein like I mentioned in the beginning, we help them quantify the invalid traffic and provide them the breakdown of the threats. Uh, so during the two weeks of trial, these were some of the metrics which we found out for the client that uh, non-incremental engagement was probably one of the biggest concerns for the client, which simply means there were same users who were coming again and again using Google as a front door to the client website. And this was simply leading to an increase in the customer acquisition cost. So the biggest challenge for this client was to control the customer acquisition cost without losing out on the conversion. Uh, this was what we identified during detection. Once we move to prevention, which is actually preventing all the invalid traffic in real time, in a span of four weeks, we were able to bring down their non-incremental engagement or the major threat to them almost down by 66%, helping them unlock budget close to about uh, a lack of rupees in just four months, a little over a lack of rupees in four months, which means this budget was available to the client to buy more valid traffic, which could have led to better conversions, and this is without factoring the customer lifetime value. So that's the power of our solution, and this was just a matter of four weeks. Obviously, this can be optimized further as, as we continue kind of optimizing with the client. 
Moving on to mobile app, uh, this is one of the leading uh, on-demand app in India. Again, uh, they, we just integrated with about six to seven of their affiliate partners. They work with close to about 10 plus partners. Uh, and in a span of two weeks, in detection, what we identified is there was about 16% invalid clicks, which were really leading to about 17% of invalid installs, which was actually con leading to about 4,000 installs per week being misattributed to the wrong source. Now remember in the beginning, like I said, on mobile we have a multi-point solution. So we identify at click, we identify at install, and we identify at conversion level as well. And if you look at it, uh, by just preventing these amongst these six to seven publishers had client moved to prevention in a span of four weeks uh, you know they could have kind of unlocked a budget of close to about 65 to 70 lakhs per month which means to the tune of about 8 crore uh, annually to kind of buy more valid traffic drive more valid users and eventually drive more valid conversions Right, so, so that's, that's the power of our solution and that's where the multi-point solution comes into picture. Uh, moving on, just to sum it up at a very, very high level, uh, ad fraud and invalid traffic is, is a global problem, costing millions of dollars to advertisers, not just in India, but globally. Uh, without prevention, what we call it is a scale of misattribution, which means where client ends up paying for installs, which should have been free, or any conversion which should have been free, just snowballs out of control. And advertisers who really need to work with uh, a preventive solution or a prevention solution with, so that you know, they can kind of scale up and grow with confidence on their affiliate campaigns. So that's from Traffic Guard. I'm around, happy to connect and take any questions as we still have some more time. Like I said, 12 minutes and sure I'll finish, so I'm right here. Thank you so much.